So here we want to extract, um, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna prompt the user to enter a zip code. I'm gonna take that zip code and I wanna go out to a web, a web service and, and, and find the state associated with that zip code. Um, this was a simple script that I put together um, you know, very quickly. And this leverages a lot of our ability to use JavaScript in various, these are like trigger points and you can trigger a JavaScript to execute um, based on an event, you know, when the batch loads or something to that effect. So here um, I have my zip code validation. You can see it's looking for the zip code. I'm gonna put in 06413, which is my whole old hometown, which is Clinton, Connecticut. And uh, we're just gonna hit the close here and close that. Now what's gonna happen behind the scenes in our batch manager, you're gonna see that particular document should be ready for us. Okay, and we should be able to come back to the screen here and here it is, zip code index two. And if we look at it now, Connecticut. So it basically took this zip code, went out and through a web service, based on that zip code, it automatically applied the state. So this is a good example of how we can leverage one unique variable, like a PO number, go out to an ERP system and populate other information, or in this case, take that one unique variable and send it to a web service to have it come back and populate information. The more information you OCR or ICR off a particular document, the more triage or manual data intervention you need to do. So this is a great tool to, um, to automate that process.